By 2030, 92.2% of the UK population will be living in the city. So I have a challenge for you. Go and experience nature. Now, I know what some of you may be thinking. You're probably wondering, my trainers get muddy. Is there any Wi-Fi? Wait, no signal? Now, if this is you, please bear with me as I tell you the many benefits of the great outdoors. Number one, the fresh air. With 40 of the UK's towns and cities at or above air pollution limits set by the World Health Organization, it's no wonder that I'm speaking about it today. Places like the countryside can offer us fresh, oxygen-rich, energizing air that our bodies are just crying out for. And secondly, your mental health. I know that I personally would have not coped during this lockdown period without the opportunity to get out into nature, go to my local park and walk my dog. We all need the space, calm and peace that green spaces can give us. And finally, experiencing wildlife. We all need to step back for a second to appreciate the vast biodiversity of nature. As humans, it's when we disconnect from nature that we begin to forget our responsibility for it. Plastic in the oceans, deforestation, excessive greenhouse gases in our atmosphere. These are all things that happen when we forget the value that nature has to our being. When I first wrote this speech, I had no idea that a global pandemic was right around the corner. A whole world has been forced to stop. But now it seems as if we're desperately trying to get back to what we had before, without even questioning if it was good in the first place. So as we rebuild society, let's change the design plans, whether that's addressing institutional racism, the vast gap between the rich and the poor, or by caring more for our environment. So go, go to your local green spaces, step back from your busy routine and experience nature. It's time we had a breath of fresh air.